Hi, here I am again. Um, today I want to talk about uh, turnkey investments. So, um, we were looking um, into investing in a home. So, the lifelong dream of being a <laughs> landlord and getting that um, apartment and renting to somebody and, you know, living out of uh, rent income. So we came across a podcast uh, from a company and we got very, really interested. It was really cheap. It was like, you know, around under $50,000, you can buy a house and we'll flip it for you and you don't have to do anything. You just pay for the house and we'll do the flipping and we'll get the tenant and we will just send you a rent in the end of the month. Um, I can't disclose the name of the company because um, legal issues. Um, so I just am going to be very general about our experience. But it was not a good one, basically. Um, we got the house. Um, we had the flipping done and we decided to go and visit this the house to see um what's going on and how things were going um as soon as we contacted the company to go see the house um they took a little while to answer and then finally when they answered they already had a tenant so we didn't have the chance to see the house after the flipping before a tenant come in Initially, we were like, oh, that's a good thing. You know, we have a tenant. Great. You know, um, but then raises the question of how long is this tenant being there that we didn't know of? We didn't know. They, they didn't tell us when the flip was over. They didn't tell us how long the tenant's been there. So we just found out because we wanted to go over there. Long story short, we went there and when we got to the house, we noticed that the flip was not something that I think anybody would be uh, able to live in. It was really badly done. It was just a slap of paint here and there, uh, some plywood and the house had holes and it was so badly done that we were really worried for the safety of the people living in the house. And then we decided that we didn't want to be a part of it. So the company was clever enough to accept um, turning the deal back and letting us out of it. But obviously for a cost of, you know, not disclosing their name and all that stuff, which we're okay with it. We got our money back. However, we seen people who had purchased and done deals with this company who didn't go through that route and they did just decided to try to sell the house that they bought um, on their own. And in the end of the day, with the flip and everything and the neighborhood that these houses are, you, you barely can get your money back from the investment. So in my opinion, based on this really superficial experience that we had with this company, um, in my opinion, uh, if you are looking into going into a turnkey investment and just be like super hands off and just getting your money in the end of the month and all that stuff, be really, really careful and try to at least um, go see the place um, at least once um, before you buy it. Um, try to see if these people are reliable because even when we were getting the rent uh, from the tenants, we were not getting it on time. We were not getting it on the first. We were getting it like on the 20 something. So the company was really, 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 really slacking. Um, again, do your research and make sure that if you're researching on that company that you're looking into do a turnkey investment, make sure that there are videos on YouTube 
and online and everywhere are not only from them. They're not only videos that the maker or the author of the video is the company because there are a lot of these companies that make real, you know, um, how to call real testimonials. And I would not uh, just believe in that based on my experience because this company that we went with, they had quote unquote um, real testimonials from real people. And uh, it turned out that it wasn't really um, as great as they seem to claim to be. If you guys have any questions um, about, you know, going into this kind of stuff, let me know. Put it on the comments if you want to make any. If you want me to make any other videos about it, um, just put it on the comments, and I'll try to answer any questions. But again, there's only so much I will be able to talk about because, as I said, we were able to get out of it with a caveat, but we were actually able to get out of it. So if you are into this situation with a company that you are unhappy with that turnkey deal. Uh, let me know and I'll try to, you know, answer how we, you know, got out. But if you are thinking about it, do your research. And if you are not really sure of it, just, I would say don't do it. I'm, I, I don't think it's a good idea. Anyways, <laughs> anyway, um, I will try to post more videos soon. Um, I'm in school right now for my new job in the military so it's been a little tricky to make videos but I'll keep posting whenever I can and post comments and ask me about you know videos that you want me to make and I will attempt to my best of abilities I will try to make another video about my experience in this school because if you are going into aeromedical evacuation like I am you are probably going to want to uh, know more about the schooling and I will make videos about it. All right. Have a good day.